everyone. Good afternoon. I'll give you a chance to settle. So for those who are coming in, welcome. This is Irene. Welcome to the yoga session. Um, this class is going to be a half hour class and we're going to practice on our breathing exercises. So for those of you who are already settled in, go ahead and sit comfortably on your mat. Remove the flesh out of your buttocks. And I like to start with breathing exercises. So you can place your hands just above your legs. You can close your eyes here. And let's focus on our breath. Taking a nice deep breath in through your nose. And exhale out the nose. Take the time to listen to your breath. Notice how your chest rises as you breathe in. And notice how your chest relaxes as you breathe out. Observe your breath. Notice your breath. Is it deep or is it shallow? Is it fast or is it slow? No judgment whatsoever. We're just here to observe. And now observe how you're sitting. Observe how your knees are. Observe your arms. Are their palms up or is it down? Observe the way your back is, your chest. Observe how you position your shoulders. Are you leaning forward or are you sitting straight? Can we relax the jaw? Can we soften the face? Take a nice deep breath in. And slow breath out. Now this time, let's breathe in through the nose and exhale out the mouth. <sighs> Let everything go. Hear your breath. Inhale through the nose. Exhale out the mouth. Again, breathing in. Exhale out the mouth. One more time like this. Now this time breathe in regularly. Inhale through the nose. Exhale out the nose. Breathing in effortlessly. Breathing out normally. One last breath like this. A 
Excellent. Now you can open your eyes. What we're going to do is we're going to start by stretching our neck here. Breathing in, place your hand to the right shoulder. Inhale. And now as you exhale, roll the head completely all the way down and all the way to the left side. Starting with some head circles. Breathing in, stay on the left side. Exhale, go ahead and roll to the right. I like to keep my eyes closed, but this is all up to you. This is your practice. Go with your breath. Inhale, stay on the left side. Exhale to roll. Take your time, breathe out, breathe out, breathe out. Breathing in, stay. Exhale to roll, slowly if you can. Breathing in, stay, open your lungs. Breathe in, exhaling. Release. Wonderful. Let's bring our head back to neutral position. We're going to bring our arms to the side and start by opening up the side. So bring the right arm all the way up to the sky. And then as you exhale, bend slightly. So allow the space to come in between the ribs. You're going to breathe in, reach up as you can, and then exhale to reach down. Beautiful. We're going to switch side. So start by breathing in first. Expand your chest, breathe in, fill your lungs with fresh air. As you exhale, empty the lungs. Feel the sides opening up, breathing in, breathing out. Take the time here, slow deep breath in, slow deep breath out. Beautiful, juicy breath. Exhaling down. As you reach up, sit tall. Exhale to bend. Allow the space to come in between the ribs. Breathing in all the way up. Exhale, coming down. We're gonna do one last one right here. Exhale to bend. Inhale, all the way up. Exhale, release. One more time, everyone. Nice deep breath in. And go ahead and breathe out. Wonderful. And let's prepare to our all fours. So coming down to your hands and your knees. Making sure your palms are just right under your shoulders and your knees are right under your hips. And let's open up the spine. So doing a cat and cow, breathing in. As you exhale, round your back, bring your chin to chest. Round it as much as you can. Inhale, open up the chest. Open up the neck and the throat. As you exhale, go ahead and roll. Bring that chin down to your chest. Inhale, open up, stretch the front of the body. And as you exhale, Feel that stretch happening on your lower back and your upper back. Keep on going, roll and roll up. Inhale, go ahead, cat and cow, breathing in. Take the time to deep, uh, take a slow deep breath out. Take a slow deep breath in. And a slow deep breath out, roll and round that back. Excellent work here. Come back to a neutral position, plant your toes, and we're going to prepare for our first downward dog. This is our first downward dog, so we can bend the knees a little bit, warm up the hamstrings. And then bring the heels up as high as you can. Take a nice deep breath in. As you exhale, try to lower down the heels as low as you can. Push it down as low as you can. Now you're going to activate your arms. Push yourself as if you're trying to lift your hips up to the sky. Relax the head and neck here. We're going to stay in this position for another three breaths. Observe your breath. Mm. 
notice the position that you're in. Do you feel it in the hamstrings? Do you feel it in your lower back? Or is it in your arms? Make no judgment whatsoever. Just observe. Take a nice deep breath in. Look forward. As you exhale, you're going to walk your feet to the front of your mat. And we're going to slowly rise up. You can bend your knees here. Bring the arms up overhead. Take a nice deep breath in. And as you exhale, bring your hands in a prayer position. Activate the palms. Push the palms against each other. We're going to do it again. Inhale. Go ahead and reach up to the sky. Now, as you exhale, bend forward. Bring the hands all the way down to the floor. You can bend your knees here or use a block if, you, if you're not able to reach for the floor. Now, inhale. Bring your hands to the knees. Flat back. Exhale. Lower down a little bit more. Now plant yourself into a plank. So lunge the right leg back, lunge the left leg back, coming into a high plank. Stay here. We'll take a nice deep breath in. As you exhale, lower down to Chaturanga. So drop your knees first and then drop the whole upper body. Upward facing dog. Inhale, open up the chest, open up the neck and the throat. And now as you exhale, coming back to downward dog. Excellent work. What you just did is a sun salutation. You're going to warm up the whole body. Take a nice deep breath in. We're going to do it again. One last full breath in this position. On your next inhale, prepare to look forward. And then exhale, you can walk your feet to the front of your mat. Begin to rise up with your breath. Inhale, work with that breath. As you exhale, close the hands into a prayer position, bringing them in front of your heart. Push the palms against each other. Activate the arms. Let's do it again. Inhale to rise up. Sun salutation serves as a warm up just before we stretch the whole muscles and then come all the way down. Now inhale, bring your hands to knees, flat back. On your exhale, go ahead and lower down. Flat yourself into a plank. Inhale, stay in a high plank. As you exhale, lower down to chaturanga. You can lower your knees down first and then lower the whole body. Upward facing dog as you breathe in. Exhaling, downward facing dog. Tuck the toes under, bring the hips up to the sky. Excellent. And stay here. Catch your breath. We've got three breaths in this position. One last breath. Inhaling. Exhale. On your next inhale, prepare to look forward. And then exhale. Walk your feet to the front of your mat. So we're going to rise up again with your breath. Inhale. Go ahead. Reach up to the sky. Exhaling. Hands in a prayer position. Wonderful. Let's do it again. One breath for movement. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, reaching down. Inhale, hands to knees. Exhale, lower down even more. Flat yourself in a plank as you inhale. Exhale, chaturanga. Remember, you can start with the knees first. Modified chaturanga, lower the whole body. Now, upward facing dog. Open up the chest. Open up the neck and the throat. Exhaling, downward facing dog. And stay. Wonderful. Good. Stay here. Take a nice deep breath in. Relax the head and neck. One more time. On your next breath, prepare to look forward. Exhale, walk your feet to the front of your mat. Beautiful. Begin to rise up as you breathe in. And exhale, hands in a prayer position. Wonderful. Good. We're going to start with our warrior one pose bring the right leg back into a 45 degree angle so that foot is at a 45 now the left leg is going to lunge bring the arms up coming into a strong warrior one pose you can stay here 
or lunge a little bit deeper. This is your practice. You choose the intensity of your stretch. Hold this position for one more breath. On your next inhale, pivot the back foot to 90 degree angle and we're going to open up to the hip, the hips to the side, coming into our warrior two pose. Arms here are parallel to the ground. Take a nice deep breath in here. And as you exhale, go ahead and lunge deeper. Making sure your upper body is not leaning forward. Bring it back so that the body or the upper torso is equal, distributed equally in between the right and the left. And let's just stay here. Hold this position. Feel your left leg strong. Your right leg is also there working actively. Arms are strong and active. One last deep breath in with this position. And exhale. Release. We're going to stretch that left arm forward. Taking a nice deep breath in. And as you exhale, Bring that left hand all the way to the floor. If you're not able to, you can grab your ankle or also use a block. From here, we're going to twist and turn and look upwards. Bring that right hand towards the sky. Breathing in for three. Exhale slowly. Notice how your breath is at this position. When the position is challenging, the breath kind of goes fast. So let's try to control and slow it down. Exhaling. Now before we go up, look down first. Take a nice in. And then as you exhale, rise up. Excellent. We're going to do a reverse warrior. So now left hand reaches up to the sky. Right hand is right behind my right leg. You can stay here or lunge a little bit deeper in a reverse warrior. Inhale. Exhale. So yoga is not just about stretching. It's also about strengthening your legs. And you're going to feel it here. And also that breath. Inhale. Exhale. And last inhale. And then exhale. Come all the way back down. Now you're going to straighten both legs. With our left hand, we're going to reach forward. With the legs straight here. Okay. Inhale. And then as you exhale. Get that left hand to touch the floor, your ankles or the block, and then let's come into a nice twist one more time. Opening up the chest, reaching the hand to the sky. Breathe. Again, one more breath. On your next inhale, look down first. And then exhale, slowly come up. Excellent. You're going to release the hands. Now we're going to pivot both feet facing the sides of the mat. All right, we're going to stretch the inner thigh here. We're going to place our hands in our waist. Take a nice deep breath in. Open up the chest. Now as we exhale, we're going to bend forward. Okay? And... Let go of your hands. Let it touch the floor. Again, if you're not able to use your block. From here, begin to relax the head and neck. Inhale. We're going to stay in this position for three breaths. Exhale. See if you can lower down the head a little bit more. Really relax the head and neck here. Breathe it in. Exhaling. One more breath in this position. Now, before we go up, inhale, straighten your arms. Exhale, plant your hands into your waist and slowly rise up. Taking your time, taking your sweet time. Beautiful, excellent work. Now we're gonna pivot and turn the opposite way. We're gonna do the whole sequence again, starting with the warrior one. So back foot is at a 45 degree angle. Lunging my right leg forward, arms up to the sky. Warrior one. And stay. Activating the arms, strengthening the legs. 
One last breath in this position. On your next inhale, pivot the back foot to 90 degree angle, allowing the hips to open up, arms coming parallel to the ground. You can stay here or go a little bit deeper into a warrior two. Stay for three breaths. Activating the arms. Strengthening the legs. One last breath in this position. Exhale, relax the hands. Right hand reaches forward. Exhale, go ahead and reach for the floor or your ankle or your block. Left hand, left hand reaches up to the sky, turning our gaze to our left hand. Breathe. And exhale, soft breath if you can. Two more. Feel your legs working. Strengthen the arms and stretch as if you're trying to touch the sky. Now inhale, look down first. Exhale, make your way up into a reverse warrior. So right hand reaches up to the sky left hand slides along the left leg breathe for three exhale you can stay here or lunge a little bit deeper this is your practice one last breath keep on gazing to your right hand now as you exhale bring the right hand forward you're going to straighten both legs now as you exhale, lower the right hand down to the floor or your ankle or your block. Left hand reaches up. Triangle pulse. Stay and breathe. Wonderful. One last breath. Deep, slow breath in and a deep slow breath out before you go up look down first inhale exhale straight your way up mm, excellent work now we're going to close our legs and we're going to do one sound salutation bringing the arms up to the sky exhaling touching down the floor inhale hands to knees exhale go ahead and reach down for the floor Plant your hands into a plank. Stay and breathe in. Exhale, lower down into Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, tuck the toes, downward facing dog. Stay here. Beautiful. One more breath here. On your next inhale, prepare to look forward. Walk your feet to the front of your mat and you're gonna come down to a seated position. Beautiful. Excellent work, everyone. Now, before we go ahead and lie down, we're just gonna work and activate our core here. So in a seated position, keep your back straight, chest up, knees are bent. We're gonna bring the arms up here parallel to the ground. Take a nice deep breath in and then exhale, lower down slightly. So feel the core here being engaged. Lift your head up, three breaths in this position. Exhale, activating the core. One last deep breath in here, everyone. Exhale, we're gonna come up, cross the legs and then bring your hands to the side and lift the upper body with those arms and release it. We're gonna do it one more round. So go ahead and sit comfortably. Lift the arms up parallel to the ground and then lean back. Now you have many options to make this a little bit more advanced. You can lift those legs up or just lean back slightly. Two more breaths, hold it. One last breath. And then exhale, you're gonna cross your legs again, bring the arms to the side and lift as much as high as you can. 
and release. Go ahead, lie down. Excellent work, everyone. We're gonna lie down. We're gonna do a little counter acting exercise for that. Place your hands to the side, coming into a bridge. With the knees bent, slowly lift the hips up and stay here for five breaths. Now you can interlace your fingers and tuck the shoulders under the shoulder blades. We've got three more breaths in this position. One last breath. Exhale, slowly relax and release. Wonderful, everyone. We're coming into our last exercise. You're gonna roll your knee, bring your knees to your chest and roll the back side to side, massaging the spine. Excellent work. Now let's bring our right or bring both knees to the right side, let it fall, and we're gonna open up the chest. Stay here, breathe. One more breath. Exhaling slowly, and once again, Bring your knees up to the middle and all the way to the left side. Support your hand, legs by using your hands and then come all the way to the left side. Whenever you're ready, open up the right arm and twist. Stay here. Breathing in and breathing out. Wonderful, one more breath. As you exhale, slowly make your way back up. And just relax your legs here. This is our last Shavasana. In this pose, there's nothing to do. Allow your legs to just absorb all the stretches and the strengthening that you did. Allow your lower back to collapse down the mat. Relax your hips. Relax your arms. Relax your chest. Relax the shoulders. Relax your jaw and your face. There's nothing to do here but breathe. And as you go back to your daily activities, always remember to take slow, deep breaths, even in the face of an uncomfortable position. You always have the control over your breath. You can stay here longer if you'd like. Otherwise, you can bring your hands in a prayer position right above your forehead. Take a nice deep breath in. Thank you for practicing with me. Namaste, everyone, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day.